An attempted sale of stolen items gone wrong. A Rio Grande City man arrested after allegedly stealing from local businesses and multiple vehicles. Our Joanna Guzman tells us how the man unconsciously turned himself in to authorities. Over $3,000 worth of power tools stolen from five vehicles over the weekend here in Rio Grande City from this residence. And the interesting part is that those tools exactly is what led police to their suspect. The individual actually left a, uh, a trail of items as he was going. The string of burglaries happened Sunday night between North Britain Avenue and East Second Street. Two local businesses and a residence were targeted, leaving the three short on laptops, cameras, and special tools. They basically emptied out almost everything. The five vehicles burglarized belong to Israel Cruz's grandfather, who is currently hospitalized. He says it took his grandpa 30 years to buy all those tools. A lot of, a lot of people like to steal, in other words. So this is, this is not the first time this has happened to us, obviously. Later that day, an alleged accomplice tried making business with the wrong person. Yolanda Olivares, the homeowner, tells us a man tried selling her stepson one of the stolen items after giving him a ride home from a store. He did take him home, and that's when he offered to sell him the, the, that tool for what, $50, I think he said. Yeah. And although 51-year-old Javier Cruz is the only suspect charged in this case, Olivares believes there's more people involved. One person alone does not go into four places at the same time. There's got to be two or three people involved. Rio Grande City Police Chief Noe Castillo says these type of burglaries are at its peak during the holiday season. The vehicles were left, left unlocked, and that's usually the case when uh, somebody's trying to pop, pop up doors and uh, when they leave something, people leave something inside a vehicle that is visible and, you know, they don't lock the door. Rio Grande City Police Chief says think twice before buying any item off the street as you can risk being charged with possession of a stolen item. In Rio Grande City, I'm Joanna Guzman, Local 23 News. Joanna, thank you. 51-year-old Javier Cruz was charged with five counts of burglary of vehicle, one count of theft of property, and one count of burglary of building. We're told the majority of the stolen items have been returned to their owners.